Hello, best friend, and welcome, welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are all having the most incredible day. Come on, let Semar. No, hang on. <clears throat> Semarchito! Best friend, welcome back to my channel. If you are new, my name is Sebastian. I am your new messy best friend. I spill pop culture tea videos every single day. So if you're looking for a new messy bestie, girl, make sure to hit that subscribe button. Best friend, girl, I look, I look insane, bitch. We were running around the whole day doing errands doing things best friend that i will let you guys know in the near future and i also went to trader joe's i got some pumpkin spice goodies so stay tuned for the end of the video but before we get into the pumpkin spice haul we got to talk about miss jennifer lopez because she was seen out in beverly hills yesterday wearing a ring on that finger Listen, let me tell you something. Everybody is, you know, basically saying like, oh my gosh, she's wearing a ring. She just can't let go. Are they divorcing? What's going on? This and that. I actually spoke to one of my girlfriends <clears throat> and I told her, what is the rule about wearing like a ring on that finger? And she goes, if you're single, you can wear a ring wherever the fuck you want to wear it. Obviously, if you're, you know, married, that's a symbol of marriage, right? Or like engagement, I guess. But if you're single, I mean, people can wear rings in every single, you know, ring finger. So it doesn't really mean anything. But because I have a PR mind, I'm thinking, girl, you know damn well people are going to be talking about you. Why succumb yourself for that? You know what I mean? Like, what is the point of having people talk about you? But anyways, girl, she was allegedly, uh, she was at a spa. And then she went to, uh, I think she went to go see some mansions, best friend. And um, listen, let me tell you something. You know what I was thinking? And I'm being so for real. I was thinking that like Jennifer Lopez, you know, there's there's so much speculation and so many things in the air, right? You know what I was thinking? Like, it would be so freaking iconic, right? You know, Wendy Williams, right? How you doing? Well, it seems like Wendy is back and better than ever. How cool would it, would it be for Wendy and JLo to sit down and have a conversation together? It would be the messiest shit in the fucking world, bitch. I know that it probably would not be Wendy who she would sit with. I think she should actually have a sit down with like Oprah, you know? I can already picture Oprah like, were you silent or were you silenced? You know what I mean? Listen, can I ask you guys a question talking about Oprah? Why don't people not like Oprah? Every time I mention people, people are like, oh my God, Oprah, this and Oprah. I'm like, girl, what did I, what chapter did I miss, boo-boo? Because last thing I know, Oprah's amazing. I'm so sweaty, bitch. I was running. Girl, it is 100 degrees outside, bitch. Listen, if it was not for my body dysmorphia, I would literally go out in a fucking crop top or like no shirt on, bitch. But like my pepperoni nipples could never. I can't, like I have such body dysmorphia when it comes to my, me, my you know, my, my man boobies. Um, anyways, girl, that's too much information. Uh, by the way, girl, somebody said like, uh, can you please not talk so much, uh, about your personal, no, about like, uh, personal information like that? Uh, I guess I was talking about like a dream I had or something. It, it, they were like, it's so cringe. I'm like, you know what's cringe? You watching a channel that you don't like the person who is, you know, on the channel. That's what's cringe. You know what's cringe is? Spending your time watching someone, your precious God-given blessed time watching someone that you don't like and that you find cringe. Okay, boo-boo? There is a lot of amazing people who are spilling tea out there. Go follow them, boo-boo. Point blank, period. Anyways, girl. Um, what do you guys think? Do you think JLo is just wearing a ring because she wants to wear a ring? Or do you think that she knows deep down inside that it's going to cause some controversy, bitch? I really, honestly, with JLo, I'm just like, girl, you are a mess with a capital M, boo-boo. Um, listen, I, I have to say that if I were in Jennifer Lopez's shoes, I would not be wearing a ring on that finger because I don't think I would want any more attention. I wouldn't want any more attention, even if... Nor, you know, even if you can just wear a ring on that finger, you know, in your normal day to day life, I just feel like it's bringing, drawing in unnecessary bad attention to you. Do you know what I mean? So I'm just sort of like, I think at this time, she should be using this time to sort of like clean up her image, clean up her act. I mean, she looks stunning. I mean, one thing about JLo is that she looks amazing. But um, yeah, I feel like she should not be drawing any type of attention on her. Okay, anyways, so I went to Trader Joe's. You guys know that I am a Trader Joe's hoe. 
and I got some um, some pumpkin goodies. They still don't have all the pumpkin uh, spice things out there, but I thought it would be fun to try them with you guys. So this is pumpkin spice cookies. And first of all, the packaging of Trader Joe's is amazing. So this is shortbread cookies with pumpkin spice and yogurt coating. Okay, girl, let's try them. Let's try this is, I mean, if you, if you have a Trader Joe's, do you know how much this, this cookie thing was? Look how big it is. It's like my head. This was $2, best friend. Two, $2.30, I think. This is what it looks like. Look, 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 look. Little pumpkins, little pumpkins. Okay. Making my way downtown. Walking fast. Chasing paths in a homebound. Do -do 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 -do. Go. Oh, mm. You know what it tastes? It tastes like um, <clears throat> honey with cinnamon. Mm. Ten out of ten, best friend. Okay, these they are pumpkin spice sandwich cookies and yogurt. Everything is in yogurt coating. Uh huh. I bought you your pump. I bought my dog some pumpkin, um, some pump dog pumpkin treats too. If if Mama's eating, uh, babies are eating too, girl. Okay, so this is. Oh, and this is with sea salt sandwich cookies and sea salt and yogurt filling. Let's try them. I love everything pumpkin, best friend. Sorry, I I, I think it's rude to smell food, right? I don't, I don't know what it looks like. Ignore my nail. Mmm. Oh, wow. Mmm. You know what? It sort of tastes like an elevated Oreo. Mmm. Best friend. Mmm. The sea salt really brings everything together. Wow. They're very rich though. Like, I feel like I could only probably honestly eat one. <laughs> Me in denial. Um, oh, June. Okay, and last, I saw this, it caught my eye so much. It is crispy peanut butter filled milk chocolate peanuts. Was this shit open? Why does it look open? No, it's not open. How do I open this? Oh. Oh, I, oh. Oops. I fucked it up. You cannot eat chocolate, sir. This is the way it looks. It literally looks like a peanut. Oh, wow. Mmm. Wow. Mmm. This, if you love peanut butter and crispy rice and milk chocolate, it's amazing. They're very rich, once again. The thing is, I have like, you know, my crumble cookies on Mondays that I did the reviews. But then during the week, I don't need any more sugar. So my, I think my, my, my body is not used to so much sugar, but it's very rich. So again, like one or two, but I made some good freaking choices today, bitch. I highly recommend it. If you're going to Trader Joe's, pick your guys self up. These, just so you know, these were like next to the frozen food aisle. And look, I, I, I'm literally talking to you guys like we're on a FaceTime call. And this one was by the chips. So this one was by the chips. They're just literally hanging there. Let me know if you get them. I believe this one was also two, everything was actually two dollars, two something like two twenty, two thirty. They're delicious, but they're very rich. And girl, trust me, it contains almond, Brazil nut, cashews, coconut, hazelnut, pistachio, and walnut. Wow. It's a it's a wonderful treat, best friend. You know what, girl? I feel like I want to freeze them. I feel like it would be really tasty. 
All right, girl, I, I ruined the package, but it's fine. I have little clips. But anyways, best friend, let me just put this out of the reach of my dog because the last thing they need is chocolate. Um, what do we think? Let me know in the comments below. I hope you guys enjoyed this little video. I love you all so much. I'm so grateful for you guys. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. You guys mean the world to me. Today, I cried talking about you guys, by the way. Um, I was talking to my mom about you guys, and I got emotional. So, yeah, I love you guys. Um, but I'll see you guys in the next video. Mwah. Bye.